morning. Good morning. Well, when senators return to Washington later today, their week is going to look a lot different. They're going to have to put all other business on pause as they now shift gears and focus solely on the impeachment trial. Former President Donald Trump's second impeachment trial is set to begin on Tuesday, one month after the deadly attack on the U.S. Capitol. There cannot be any healing without truth without accountability. Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer says the Senate will conduct a full and fair trial. First, senators will hear arguments from the nine House impeachment managers, who plan to argue that Trump was solely responsible for the January 6th attack, and that the former president encouraged the attack by repeatedly refusing to concede the election. Then, the president's attorneys will make their case, arguing that the trial is an unconstitutional overreach by Congress. In a memorandum released last week, Trump's legal team said that the former president did not incite rioters to attack the Capitol. They went on to say that the article of impeachment violates Trump's right to free speech. We're in Congress. We're not prosecutors. South Carolina Republican Lindsey Graham said on CBS Face the Nation that many senators have already made up their mind. I'm ready to move on. I'm ready to in the impeachment trial because I think it's blatantly unconstitutional. But others, like Pennsylvania Republican Pat Toomey, said on CNN's State of the Union that he's still on the fence. I'm going to listen to the arguments on both sides and make the decision that I think is right. The Senate is set to convene at noon on Tuesday. Now, that's when they will officially begin the trial. Uh, first, we'll hear from the House impeachment managers. They'll first present their case to the senators on Tuesday, and that could take up to three days. Live in Washington, I'm Anna Warnicke. Back to you. All right, thank you, Anna. Now,